thank you Juan. But before anything else, I will introduce to you our participants. From the Team A, Benibel Cabalgas. And for the Team B, Shane Lyon. Please give them a round of applause. our criteria and policies for judging. Clarity of voice, 20%. Thoughts and information, 60%. Presentable attire, 20%. With a total of 100%. Policies for this debate. First, each participant should be responsible for their words and actions. Second, our participant will be having a pick of who? will be given 10 seconds to analyze their sides. And lastly, the overall duration for debate is limited to 10 minutes, so each participant must defend, defend their sides for only 30 seconds and vice versa. So let's start with a pick of who. give you a topic. Which is the best for Philippine bayan? Sinigang or adobo? Since Team A won, Miss Cabalies will choose her side. Miss Cabalies? I choose adobo. The remaining team will depend Sinigang. of the brain figurine. You know, I want you to know that adobo is the best and a well-known dish in the Philippines. And you know that? That the adobo is the food of all time and the food of all season. That's why adobo should be the national dish in the Philippines. No, I strongly disagree. I can say that sinigang is still the best. Why? Because sinigang has a vegetables. And vegetables give us vitamins and minerals for our daily activity. That's why I can say that sinigang is still the best. We can get also a vitamins in the adobo by its ingredients and the sauce that has a protein and also adobo is easy to serve when it comes to occasions no i can say that sinigang is still the best because um, it is easy to serve too just like adobo but um, uh, we can afford to buy vegetables and like meat so what if we don't have meat or any or chicken or pork? Um, sinigang is sinigang can be we can cook sinigang with or without meat. That's why sinigang is still the best. 